my channel and thank you so much for being here today. I am super excited. I might have found a powder that is either better or just as darn good as my holy grail powder that I've been using for years. So if you want to know more about that, hit the subscribe button, share this video so somebody you think might like it, and let's do it. So I have my foundation on and my concealer on. This is where I would normally powder. I have to thank you guys so much. You all send me some amazing product recommendations. You've been hearing me say it quite often that it's something that you guys have requested or something you guys have told me about. I just have the most amazing community, the most amazing support system here on um, YouTube. You know, the L Squad is just the best. And so I wanna thank you for this. So as you know, I've been teasing this out for a little bit. My favorite setting powder, finishing powder, in life is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powders. I use Diffuse Light underneath my eyes and probably pretty much all over the face as well. You saw me review this guy. So what I have been done, what I have been doing is I have been using these two together, which is Dim Light and Diffuse Light. So dim underneath the eyes and then combined all over. Now this came from you guys. Have you guys tried this before? It's not new, I just didn't know about it. It's called ELF Halo Glow Setting Powder. What? Okay. Y'all, let's talk about it. So first of all, I've got the same brushes for the face. I am using the same brush for underneath the eyes. So this is a BK, the underneath the eyes is my BK Beauty 109, 108, and the face is a BK Beauty 107. Pick your favorite. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go in here, which is diffuse light, and I'm gonna do hourglass on this side. So I'm going to show you what I normally do. Tap, 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 and put it on. Okay, that's where we got it. Ready? Now for the rest of the face, I will do combine the two colors together. Do, 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 do. And I will tap, and I will tap, and I will diffuse. Now, I understand that these are setting powders. I understand that this is not necessarily for setting, okay? But if you have a drier skin type, more mature, like a little bit more glow, you can skip the setting powder. This is still powder, and it still will set it, but it also leaves the face with a beautiful natural glow. Do you see how it has absolutely set this a little bit more than this side, so you guys can absolutely see the difference? Okay, so that's my holy grail. That's what I've been using for God knows how long. You ready for the other one? <laughs> um, it just, I don't think that this comes in different colors. Correct me if I'm wrong and I'll put it up on the screen if I am wrong. Um, that's the only thing that sucks, um, the elf one. But here we go. So it says tap into the thingy, the cap, go like this, swirl around. Okay, you ready? Do the exact same thing. Tap, 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 tap and swish. Do you see that there's not a ton of difference? It's crazy. Okay, I'm gonna do the same thing, same brush, I mean, different brush, but same, you know, same model um, for the rest of the face. Tap, 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 just like I did the other side. Tap, 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 and buff. You guys, do you see the glow? Do you see the glow? I am blown away by the similarity of the finishes that you get from these powders, from, from the e.l.f. and from obviously the hourglass, you guys. It is almost undetectably different. There's a few caveats I'd like to say. I don't love this, it's not my favorite for setting underneath the eyes. I still go with this over this, but if you had to, if that's like, you know what, I'm just gonna get one, it will do a good job, obviously you can see. I just find it has a tendency to grab a little bit more than the Hourglass one does, okay? So like on concealer, you can actually kind of see it just a touch right here. And I have the exact same concealer and everything on over here. So just a heads up on that. But nothing like a little pressing in with like just a beauty blender um, can't take care of. I mean, to be very, very honest. The price difference is incredibly different, obviously. And another thing is I will say, this is a loose powder. So for me, this is a, obviously this is a baked powder, which means that it once was a liquid, 
it was baked and then now is a powder. So this ultimately is going to be more of a refined quality. It's going to be a little bit more of a refined texture on the skin just because of the way that it um, is made. But you guys, if you are sleeping on this, so say for example, you know, you really, really want this, but you don't want to, you know, don't want to spend and splurge the money. Can you tell the difference? I can't. So if you're sleeping on this, I just had to share it with you. I have been using it almost straight for a week and I just wanted to test it out, give it a real good, you know, wear test. Cause if I'm going to say something's just as good as my Holy Grail, I need it to be the truth. And you know, I don't speak anything but the truth over here. So if you guys are sleeping on this, if you guys want that kind of hourglass glow, but not with the price tag, Go get yourself some e.l.f. I'll link everything in the description box. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short, quick little video. I just couldn't wait to share it with you. Let me know in the comments section, have you guys tried this? Uh, am I like totally the one sleeping on this? Did you guys already know? Um, if you did, correct me and I'm happy to, to, happy to be a part of the team now. So uh, anyway, thank you all so much for being here and I'll see you in the next one. Lots of love from me to you. Bye loves. If you stayed to the end, I just wanted to show you, I put on my bronzer and my blush. And this is how my face would normally look. Get up real close. You can't see a difference. Just wanted to let you know. See you soon.